Hey, we told you we might have a guest coming. We wasn't sure. It's on, yeah. It's on. And uh, this is Carol. Yeah. And she, see this one star? She's a brigadier general. And she's from the adjutant general's office. And then I just found out, I guess she's the commander of the Peace. Air National Guard. Air National Guard. Because yeah. we get out of the Peace Greeters all the time. What a great, great mission. You carry a star with your carol all the time? I do. Oh, I have good. more than one, as a matter oh, of fact. I have one in my office, yeah. yeah? Absolutely. What a great effort, uh, the Peace Greeters. We started out as a small group of folks oh, yeah. just gathering together to welcome yeah. home and to send, uh, send off to our veterans. And it has grown with national notoriety. Yeah. I know you've been to visit the president, and uh, what great work. Uh, it's such a relief and a, just a warmth to know that veterans from all eras uh, say welcome and thank you to <laughs> veterans of every era. It's so very important. We've learned some great lessons uh, from our Vietnam veterans who we always try to welcome home. Uh, and their service to our continuing uh, veteran population is just, just superb, and they've been a great model for us uh, for the future. This is uh, our eighth Career? ninth year coming up here. That's terrific. And, and, and tell me a little bit, Norm, so you bring some uh, veterans from well, our nursing homes? We got five homes? nursing homes in Rochester, yeah? plus the Riverside Rest Home in Dover, the county home. Yes. And we sponsor them. Yes. We visit them one day a month, and then we take all of them out one day a month somewhere. Oh, wow, that's and, terrific. And like next month, we'll be going to the soldiers' home in Tilton. Yes, yeah. And we'll have a cookout. Yeah. Uh, Tilton's invited here. They're also invited down to our legion in April as guests. Uh, we've had a couple of the other generals uh, yes. come in and talk to us. Yes. And uh, what's her name there from uh, New Durham? General Carter. Yeah, we, we uh, had her in the parade. Yes. And uh, that was very nice. Everybody enjoyed that. Yeah, well, it's just, you know, it's, it's, it's wonderful. We have quite a great veterans population in the state of New Hampshire. So it's great with ways that we try to still continue to stay connected to our veterans. Yeah. Uh, even though they're in uh, in situations where they can't normally be in their home setting. It's very nice that you take that upon them. What a great way to stay connected with our community and to continue to show that. You're a great model for those of us who are veterans from this era uh, to pay it forward. Well, we got a lot of World War II veterans here. That's Korea terrific. Veterans. Yeah, and, I am married to a Vietnam veteran. Yeah. So, uh, so we... This have... Kentucky Fried Chicken comes all the way up from Rasa, caters this. Terrific. And the Cumberland Farms finishes of the ice cream. What better thing it, yeah, to have everybody. on a summer day yeah. than, than uh, yeah, Kentucky yeah. Fried Chicken and ice cream? Everybody helping everybody. <laughs> yeah, it and, really is. Yeah, and uh, there are, we have 14 members of the Veterans Council. Terrific. And then, and half of them, are, the reps are here. Yeah. But uh, we really uh, enjoy having you come. Yeah. Uh, well, the vets get like get a chance. If you get a chance, I will go out and talk to, shake some of their hands. They don't see I know. shaking hands with I, the one <laughs> side too often, you know. Oh, it's and, my pleasure. Uh, and uh, Celeste is from our government channel in Russia. This is all going to be showed on the government channel. Terrific. Terrific. So. Oh, well, I just want to publicly thank you for the work okay. that you do in support of our veteran community in the state of New Hampshire. And I pass on the great words of, and the great greetings from our adjutant general of the state of New Hampshire, Major General Bordell. And yeah. he also thanks he you. He was here two he years was, ago. He was, and he always, uh, he's just not available today, but he always likes to spend an opportunity to spend time with veterans, uh, knowing that that's, uh, you know, on the backs of our fellow veterans and our former veterans, our veterans of today succeed. So we thank got you for that. A, uh, Flight waiting for us down there. Yeah, when is when is it? Well, everybody got everybody got put aside till after after uh, uh, September. Yeah. So we're going to check up on it again. I'll be right down to see you. Yeah, oh, that's great. Get, we'll get look us forward on the to list. It. Well, you know, you're the biggest thing going at, at sometimes at that terminal at Pease. Yeah. You know, <laughs> with the Pease greeters. But I, I tell you, I've, I've just the great feedback we get from uh, okay. our current veterans about the they they are overwhelmed with the support of Pease okay. greeters. Well, you're welcome to stay and eat. Well, thank you. But at least you might want to go around. I will. Hands with some of the vets. I will do that. And nice Norm. to meet you. And well, I'm it was so my glad, pleasure to meet you. So glad you showed up. You bet. Take okay, care. Thank you. You bet.